Welcome back. Happy to have Tiffany Ward with Indulge Salon and Tanning in Studio. We're going to talk about a hairstyle that I absolutely love, but I have a very hard time replicating um, because it's hard to do on yourself sometimes. So you're going to give us some tips on how to do a blowout. And as you can see, very voluminous hairstyle. Yes. Yeah, so blowouts don't have to be voluminous, but that's my preference. It does look very nice um, but on this lovely lady. <laughs> she is beautiful. <laughs> um, a blowout is really setting and prepping the hair mm -hmm. properly. So you have all the products in it. You want to have a, a styling products, volume products, heat protectant products, and finishing products. We set the hair when it's wet, mm -hmm. dry it in a very specific way with all of our wonderful tools, and then it lasts for yeah. a week. Right, and so the first step, of course, is to get your hair wet, right? Yes, you wash, wash your it. hair. Really good deep cleanse wash is what you want to do. Um, and then you want to prep the hair with styling prep. Okay. We love Listen. It's actually locally made here in Minnesota. Oh, cool. We yeah. So you want to prep the hair with products that are going to give you some hold and also smooth out and uh, protect it from any frizz or elements. Then maybe some volumizing products you're mm -hmm. going to want to put in at, focus at maybe more on the root or anywhere you want volume. So she's got volume from the root probably to the mids. Um, and then definitely heat protectant. Yep. You want to have heat protectant and then finishing products. But these are more what you're going to use when the hair is wet. Mm. Then you'll use round brush, mm -hmm. blow dryer with a nozzle. And this is what's really hard to do on your own, yeah. um, even as a hairstylist. Because it's, it's about tough. the direction that you're pushing the hair. It is all about the, the direction that you're pushing the hair and how hard you're pulling on it or the tension that mm -hmm. you use. And then the magic wand thing that we do to right. give it just this little bit of bounce and curl on the end. Or if you want it really sleek and smooth, that takes some special technique too. And so where, like, uh, when is a proper time to uh, have a blowout? All right. So either weekend or just before you're going to go out okay so it's the or every day you, 5 a.m please <laughs> <laughs> um right before we, the show we get that a lot and so it's the beginning of the week is a great yeah, time to do it, it so that you don't have to mess with your hair the rest of the week right wow. it stays for a while it does and we've got different things in the salon too that you can use to keep your hair set at night mm -hmm. if you think back to like our grandmothers they used to go in and get their roller set yeah. once a week it's the same concept. We're setting the hair so that you can, the rest of the week is super easy for you. Or yeah, come in on Friday or Saturday mm -hmm. and then you're ready to go all weekend. And So my question about the, the bangs section, like if you've got some bangs, do you just kind of go straight up and hope that it <laughs> doesn't like give you a George Washington? Like what, is, what do you yeah. do? Because I had, mine were Sticking yeah, straight up and so it work. depends on the look that you want. Okay. I have a really strong cowlick, so I typically just go with it and let it be big in the front and roll it back. Um, if you want to wear a bang down, mm -hmm. you absolutely can do that too and set it so that they don't just fall flat on your forehead, sure. but you can set it properly with, again, a round brush and all the right products. We also have to talk about uh, Pink Friday, which mm -hmm. is a big initiative to support small businesses before Black Friday happens. Yes. So talk about that. So Pink Friday really started just a couple of years ago. It's a huge movement with boutiques that you shop local first. And now it's moving on even beyond boutiques. And I just love it. So we're celebrating Indulge's 21st birthday. And yeah. we decided to collaborate with our neighbor, Winton & Co. Mm. Um, who, that's a boutique. Mm. And so we're having our big birthday party on Pink Friday, oh, this Friday. Mm -hmm. So what's so cool. the time for that? Three to six. Okay. And we're going to be doing free blowouts. You have to just schedule online, free blowouts. Get ready for Friday night. Yeah. We'll have sweets and treats from other local businesses as well. And Botox appointments and then Boutique shopping. I mean, like, what what better Friday? That sounds like a perfect Friday to right. me. Oh, Start yeah. the weekend off. Thanks so much for joining us, yeah. and we'll have more when we come back on Cato Living.